Right, quick video, how to enable and disable the interior lights on your Range Rover Sport. So you might have been playing around with something and then when you open your car door, your interior lights are supposed to come on here and in the footwell. But no, no, they don't. And you think, that's the fuse gone. But then you think, well, hold on, the interior lights still work. Because look, I can turn it on and off. But, but even if you turn that on and off and open the door, it's still not coming on with the door. Um, right, so there is a way of enabling and disenabling it. Right then, so if you press and hold, watch the dashboard, right? So press and hold, and this light will flash as well. You get a double flash, and it says interior lights auto. Okay, and now when we open the door, well, they've come on now, and then when we close the door, eventually they'll go off. I think if I lock the cars, lock us in here, Dan. They should fade and go out, look. All right unlock the door they come on when you open the door there we go so that's how you do it well let's have a look what else then if we press and hold it again make two flashes on the lights and it's off so it it toggles between so if you watch up here dan so you press and hold you'll see it do a double flash yeah and that will then correspond with the message so we're back on auto so that's how to enable and disable the shall we also do the mood lighting dan yes are you ready for yeah, some mood lighting dan who was it that said dan should be in what was it what did they what tv show are they recommending you for now dan i can't even remember it was i can't remember love it wants to love yeah, island yeah, dan right, yeah. for love island hashtag da, dan for love island Right then. Not a chance. Not a chance, no. He's in the powerful UK Love Island. Right, we're waffling. Right, what we got to do? So in here, there is a setting to change the interior lights, the ambient lighting. You know, we know, did you know we have this now? No. Right then. And so you get there. Now, I was trying to work out which ambient lights it actually does, but it doesn't seem to do that many. Now, if you look around this little glove box here, Dan, can you see, lift your little arm up there, look. See, we've got some redness going on there. But the footwells and the door lights, on my Evoke, I get a, a door light as well, but there's no, is there no door, is there a door pocket light there, Dan? I can't see a lot going on. No, it doesn't look like it. On the back, no. Um, but you can change the colour of it, so you could have blue if you want. And now if you look, look, we've got some blue ambient lighting going on. So there you go, there's another thing. Um, and obviously, I think you can change the intensity, the intensity of it. So that's obviously, that's obviously full, three quarters, half. And does that does that tone it down a bit? You know, you watch there, Dan. I'll, that's that's quarter, half, three quarters, full. Yeah, tiny bit. A tiny bit. Yeah, might might do. So there we go. That's how to sort of set all your mood and disable and in i guess if you were doing something a bit dodgy somewhere in a car park dan you know <laughs> what i'm talking about you might want to turn your interior lights off or something but there we go who knows i hope that video has helped someone